desertification is one of the most serious environmental and social economy problems in the world today. And about one quarter of the landmass and two thirds of the countries in the regions are endangered and suffering harms caused by desertification. Visited this specific country, the grass was helping lift 30,000 local people out of poverty. Junshao, which literally means mushroom and grass, can be used, as its name suggests, to grow edible mushrooms as livestock feed or as a grain barrier to stop desertification. As noted by the UN, its real power comes from how these activities contribute to broader social issues, such as poverty eradication, clean energy, and other targets listed in UN's 2030 Agenda for Sustainable Development. It is no wonder that this plant, cultivated by Chinese scientists, is often called a magic grass. However, it would have never been introduced to the world without the support of President Xi Jinping. In the mid 1980s, when Xi started working in Fujian Province, he dedicated considerable energy to rural development and poverty alleviation. At that time, mushroom farming was booming in the countryside, and it was lucrative. In a vicious cycle. Farmers felling trees on moss for fungi substrate were causing deforestation, which caused economic stagnation. A potential solution the future president of China discovered. For many underdeveloped countries, Junshao technology is an affordable, accessible, and environmentally sound way to generate much-needed opportunities. In my country, Junshao technology has benefited my people. It is a good initiative by the、uh, President Xi Jinping with the invention of the better road and using Junshao technology, we can be able to improve ecology, poverty alleviation, and even to produce mushrooms, functional food, feed, fertilizer, biomass energy, biological materials. And also to be applied in environmental protection and ecological treatment. Junshao technology makes use of grass and fungi to achieve the efficient utilization of natural resources such as solar energy, air, water, and soil to address the growing challenge and benefit humankind.